frontier at Kilimanjaro. Kilimanjaro. We're fighting to end hunger. Yours. Want to be too scared to go outside? The news is next. Leanne Forget, WCTR State Controlled News. Prom from happening again. Richard is on the streets with rescue workers. Uh, <laughs> Leanne, I don't know if you ever covered a riot. But the scene here is amazing. Rescue workers are opening up a car with the jaws of life right here. It is so cool. Hey, shut up, bitch. I'm interviewing. I'm, what, you're ruining my report. Shut up. Hey, hey, rescue guy, come here, come here. Richard Burns, WCTR News. How's it going? You dumbass, I'm trying to save this woman. Get out of here. I'm trying to save this woman to get back. Yeah, well, see if I give you any beers from my news truck, you overpaid prick. Leanne, this town's gonna need some people. Back to you. Uh, hey, why don't you use the jaws of life on your fat wife, dude? <laughs> Did you hear me rank him up with breath? I'm so glad you're okay, Richard. <laughs> hey, baby, are we off the air? I looted some great stuff for our apartment. A fat bearskin rug, a new blender, a double ender, a... Currently, we have no more information. And in entertainment news, the comeback of the year. Disgraced drunkard Mad Dog, who was recently saved from jumping to his death by a mystery assistant, is on top of the charts with a new album and a sellout tour plan. Yes, people, the wait is over. Man. Okay, we are back in the garden. I'm Maurice, and we must answer nature's call. Going to the phones. Greetings, garden lover, what's your name? Hi, my name's Trish. Okay, is that short for Patricia? Uh, yeah. Oh, that's what I asked. Name, not nickname. Skin head, wearing friends call you at the rally. You should do less drugs and learn to try a bit harder. Next caller! Hi, my name is Colleen, and my husband has a topiary problem. Ooh. This sounds serious. Well, we started off small scale, just recreational usage. You know, doing horses and cockroaches, yeah, and unicorn. But it's kind of gotten out of control. How so? He just can't stop. I mean, people think it's all funny things. But what happens when the party stops? What happens then? Okay, just, just hold the phone. Hold the phone and... Elephants, rhinos, all of them carved out of hedges. Penguins, dogs, velociraptors, you name it, he's made a leafy version. What could be more natural than a man trimming a hedge into the shape of Very therapeutic makes a man feel like a god when you can twist nature to your own perverse entertainment when you know we've won. We made Darwin. But now he's trimming bushes into a spaceship, a rocket, and a lance. He runs around with hedge clippers and screams, Trim that brush at our neighbors! He even fastened a shrub into a kangaroo with a pouch, and he sleeps inside his oh, sunlight. Exactly so fun. he's freaking out on bush. He needs help. Please, you've got to help me. I hate hedges. Well, the Romans love topiary, and look at their contributions to society. But as they say, if the grass is greener in the other fella's yard, I'll be saying a caller's son out of town. Okay, next caller. Whoops, hold on a second, I'm blossoming. There we go, all done. My name is Henry. I want... Are you blossoming? I, uh, I guess I am. I've really come into my own in the past few months since I joined a cult and began tithing money in exchange for spiritual happiness and letting everyone take turns on my wife. What? Anyway, I have a lovely guard. Mostly carnivorous plants. A Venus flytrap reminds me of my mother. She's in prison now. Anyway, it's so fascinating how it catches animals and eats them. I started with flies, and now mine can swallow a whole squirrel. Or a small horse if I chop it in half first. 
have you tried any experiments on human beings? Yeah, I've been working on that. Good man! Good man! See, the secret of nature is once something is at the height of beauty and potential, it is time for it to live and die. A bit like the British Empire. Look that old place withering and dying right before our eyes. It's run by a queen. And if she had a pistol, she'd be the king. Luckily, in this country, we don't have to But hell, I'm all over the place here, so easy to get out of control. You better wake up when you something that comes natural. Line two, you're on gardening with Buddy. Yeah, my name is Terrence. Can I call you Telly Welly? Uh, sure, I, I guess. I'm going to flowers, but sometimes I get really angry and fly off the handle from the herbicide. I don't mean to. I say, I don't mean it, baby. You'll be all right. Then I cry and wear a diaper for two days. A flower? Nothing more than an educated weed. And like all weeds, all living things need to be extinguished. Like a life support machine or a, or a cigarette, which I won't be able to smoke anymore if the fascists in the state government have anything to say about it with that damn proposition. 421. Tobacco is a plant, people. And, and, and if it comes out of the ground, we should be able to smoke it like coal and opium. Next call. Yeah, I got a question. Why is everybody on the radio named Maurice? I pray to the great gardener in the sky that you've been fixed. Whoa, I no. hope they sniffed your nuts off, because spreading your seed could be a disaster. Do you, do you have a question? A question? God! That's just a touch. Tarn. Yeah, that guy was talking about bugs and plants that eat them. I got a better solution. Put pesticide in the sprinklers. My kids. Love it. I mean, the ones that live. Oh, lovely. Just here it. to help my man get back on his feet. In the pen, we play strip right, football. right there, CJ. Them fly. I gotta wear these. I'm a player. Right over here, baby. We gonna roll, I'm homie, or what? For the MWF, homie. I'm always down. Hey, can you take a picture of me? Hey, what's jump? So what's the 411? Hey, right over here. I made that. It goes on. I'm Maurice. Until next time, hey, dig a hole and plant yourself. That was the show that generates more phone calls than any other on WCTR, Gardening with Maurice. All the news the government wants you to hear. WCTR.